The other day I saw a really cool tool to help you build a landing page visually and deploy it to Netlify and it's free and open source. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna show you it now. So this is the main repo and let's see, one second. Um, so this is the main repo, it's created by Live Duo uh, and there is his starter project right here. And he suggests forking it and working with it that way. Um, Live Duo, if I were you, I'd create this as a template. That'd be really nice. And also, as you do, um, can you create a public uploaded directory? So our pictures, there's a bug right now, essentially, and you have to have the directory there. Uh, it can't automatically create it. And I was having problems before with it. So if you see this video by any chance, um, make this into a template and add this directory right here. Um, so in order to get started, uh, if Live Duo ever makes his into a template, you can use that template or you can fork it or you can use my template which has this folder built in already so if you upload images it will work right away uh, for example we'll use mine uh, we'll say use this template um, I'll call it demo landing and we don't need any of this other stuff we'll create a repository we'll say git clone HTTPS demo Landing.get. We'll see if that works. It does. CD demo landing npm install to get everything going. You literally don't even need to open your code editor to work with this. It's super nice. Uh, and then we'll say npm run dev. And there we go. And it will be on this URL. We'll go look at it here. And this is the editor. Now, the way it works is when it deploys in the production environment, there is no editor. Uh, but when it deploys with your development environment, there is an editor. So we'll just get rid of this. Uh, and then let's see, we'll add a header. So we'll go here, find a header. Boom, we can re rename this text to demo landing. Uh, and that looks nice. And then maybe let's see, we also want a hero section. We'll put that right here and we'll upload an image. Oops. Um, and we'll upload this picture of me right here. Uh, there we go. And we'll add that image and we'll say, uh, oops, Christopher recommends, I think that's what you spell recommends, using the stack. And we'll change this to, let's see, settings, text, try it. It's a URL and we'll link here. There we go, it'll open a new tab, perfect. And you know, I'm, I'm satisfied with my changes. So we edited a button where it links to the text of a button. We added a picture, changed some text. You can see it's pretty cool. Uh, so when we're done there, we'll say git add git commit uh, m and then the name or whatever update you want to call. So we'll say initial landing. We'll say git push. Now it'll push up to my repo. He oops, not discord. Hopefully I didn't show anything bad. Uh, that pushes back to here. And what's going on? What is it? Okay. Um, so now we're going to go to Netlify. We're going to say new site from Git. We're going to deploy it from GitHub. It'll authenticate me. I'm going to find a repo demo. Uh, so landing. There we go. Uh, it knows that it's a Next.js site, so we don't have to do anything here. Uh, you can just go with the, or the regular settings. Um, and it should work for you. So we'll deploy the site. And now it's working on deploying. And in a couple of minutes, it will be ready. Um, let's see if there's anything else I should show you. Okay, so this is the, oh, this is the, the main repo. Um, also, this might be useful to see. Um, it's, not, it's not your starter repo. It is like the repo to describe the project. Um, some of the features. Um, the builder, it really is nice. Obviously you saw how easily, easily I could edit stuff. Um, I haven't tried using forms, but obviously I added a picture of myself. That was pretty easy. Uh, yeah, so everything's pretty easy. Um, you can also add it to a project you already have, but, uh, I didn't do that. Let's see how it's going to build or into playing right now. So it's working its way through right now. Maybe we can uh, change our site setting or site settings. Yeah. Say, um, the stack 
example. Let's see if that's available. There we go. Let's open the link in a new tab. Um, it's not ready yet. Still building. Cool, everything seems to be working. And shortly this should be live. Build complete, set as live. Let's so go back, and all of a sudden, bada bing, bada boom, we have a landing page. It was super easy to create. It looks nice and clean. Um, there's a try it, it opens in a new tab, the link we set. Everything is super sweet, super easy to get set up. It's free, uh, you don't have to rely on um, anything. I mean, like you could deploy this any way you want. You could deploy using Versal. Uh, Versal is the one who created Next, so that makes it super easy. Um, also, Netlify works, and Netlify is what I prefer. Um, just because that's what I'm used to, but certainly you can use whichever you'd like. And yeah, it's just super easy platform. Live Duo, great work. This is a really cool tool, tool and I'm grateful it exists. So thank you. Uh, also, if you made it this far in the video, please uh, leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe. I would appreciate that a lot. All right, bye.